When it comes to the topic of property rights, anarchists have a distinct and often misunderstood view. Anarchism, as a political ideology, is centered on the idea of abolishing all forms of hierarchy, oppression, and exploitation. In this sense, property rights are viewed as a means of upholding systems of domination and control over others, rather than protecting individual freedom. Anarchists believe that property rights are inherently unjust, as they give certain individuals or groups control over resources and means of production that are necessary for the well-being of everyone. This concentration of power and wealth in the hands of a few leads to economic inequality and reinforces existing power structures. Furthermore, anarchists argue that the concept of property is based on a false assumption that individuals can own land or resources, when in reality, these things are part of a larger ecosystem that is interconnected and cannot be truly owned by anyone. Anarchists believe in the principle of use, not ownership, meaning that individuals should have access to resources based on their needs and usage rather than their ability to claim ownership. Instead of upholding property rights, anarchists advocate for the common ownership of resources and the means of production, where decisions are made collectively and based on the needs of the community as a whole. This system, known as libertarian socialism or communalism, emphasizes cooperation, mutual aid, and self-governance, rather than competition and individual gain. In conclusion, the anarchist view on property rights challenges the traditional notion of ownership and highlights the ways in which it perpetuates inequality and oppression. By advocating for the common ownership of resources, anarchists aim to create a more just and equitable society based on cooperation and mutual aid.